back with uh, another review here. So this this is the other thing I got in the mail. Uh, I got this one for uh, this is like the cheapest Go Ranger figure I've ever gotten. Uh, I got them for like ten dollars, <laughs> mint and bag too. Uh, his I'll show you here. This is a boat ear mask. And uh, the reason why I got them so so dirt cheap, I mean, these things usually go for $80, $90. The cheapest you can get them at $60, $70 sometimes. It all, it all varies, but uh, this part uh, was broken off. It's actually not really broken off. It, um, if you can see here, it's in the seal here. It's just kind of come unglued. I, I think I'm going to have a friend quickly... Just spray paint over that and just get rid of that weird mark and then I'll stick it in there and uh, glue it and then it'll be good to go. But uh, yeah, I, I just wanted, I was like, oh, you know, I'm not really, like I wasn't a big fan of this guy in the episodes. He's just kind of another goofy villain. Uh, so not one of the big ones that I really recall, you know, episode 11. Uh, something, something, green shutter, the, the, the boat, the, the ear hell or something that's titled, it's really weird, but, um, he was after, uh, actually, what he's after, he was after a weapon to, uh, use something called minus energy, scientists have produced some energy, or some sort of method that harnesses energy to, use and he was going to use it to uh, basically blow up the earth or something stupid but um they stopped him but i, I just read on their their wiki that apparently that actually plays a big bigger part in later series so you can look that up i'll post the links on it but that was kind of interesting so yeah but uh his weapon he's got like a little they didn't sculpt it on here but he's got like a little hole there and he can shoot like you know bullets out or energy or whatever and he can hit him over the head with <laughs> it's like a giant kind of a paddle he can use on some kid or something to paddle him or something it's really weird but i don't know why he's called boat ear mask like i don't know what what that is i don't know what this pattern is if that's some sort of thing that's exclusive to Japan, you know, culturally or not. I don't know much about it. I know he's got kind of like one of those kind of geisha looking faces or, or you know, whatnot, but, uh, but, uh, yeah. So he just got the black cape. He's basically got a nice really blue, dark navy blue cape, so. Yeah, that's Boat Ear Mass. I don't have too much to say about him. He's kind of just, uh, kind of another kind of forgotten face in the series but you know i'm i'm already halfway through collecting these so i i'm, I'm just collecting them all you know and if i can get them for 10 bucks you know that's a steal so anyways i hope you enjoyed the review and uh stay tuned goodbye